this is an experiment with the two lawn trains. Uh, the setup is that I've got the cover sun and the main leading lawn train is right at the front, the, the ring right at the front of his, uh, his nose. And then you can see I've got a second lawn train which actually goes from uh, the rain on the inside of the cover sun through the roller. And as far as I'm concerned, this is mostly inactive, as you will see through, during the videos. Um, and the only reason why I have it is because that way, if he's trying to turn his, his head to the outside and turn his front away from me, um, he won't find that so easy to do. I'm doing that as a preventative measure so he can't or won't learn to turn away just, just on a halter and a, and a rope like he did, I think, in what I called session number three. You will see that he's done that and I don't want that to become a habit so I'm making it just that little bit harder for him. This is actually the most I have seen him go forward and I would almost say he almost looks a bit like he's enjoying being able to actually go. Obviously the other um, rope, the Pirelli halter and, and the uh, lead rope are really too short to uh, lunge horses effectively because they make the circle too small and especially for a horse like him that has some discomfort issues and also um, is very young and unbalanced, a really small circle is very, very hard. And I think even for a lot of horses, just I'm going on a circle that, is hard, even a bigger circle. And I think he's managing this one actually quite well, so I'm quite pleased. But um, yeah, I think we needed to do the, the proper lunch right and stuff that? because I think the mm. lead rope and the small circles have had their day. He needs to go forward now and enjoy himself a little bit.
this is his more difficult or more uncomfortable side. And I have to drive him quite a lot now, I think, because he's also getting a bit tired, because I think this is the most work that he has done in quite a while. I'm quite pleased with that little experiment and you can see here how that has stopped him from going, turning around and going the wrong way, stopped him dead in his tracks. And that's exactly what I have it for. It's done the trick because he mustn't learn to turn around and then just do what he wants. And um, it's also nice that he can move a little bit more freely. He doesn't have to worry about his balance quite so much. And um, he knows he knows how to lunge. I know that because I'm not teaching him anything new here. I'm just reviving some old knowledge. 
He's on a roll now. <laughs> oh, that looks beautiful. <laughs>